welcome or welcome back to my channel hope you guys are all doing well so for today's video i have three in one chit chat get ready with me as you already know from the title obviously i'm going to be doing my hair makeup and putting together a little outfit to go together with the whole look today's sponsor is sally hair my favorite am i pronouncing it right i don't know i think it's silly silly or sally oh my god i can't speak my retainers um here i have the highlight body wave wig 13 by 4 lace front wig colored human hair lace wig this is what it looks like i've already worn it as you can see i've already cut the lace off i've already bleached the knots i've already um oh there's a bit of glue there I've yeah really customized it. <laughs> it is 24 inches. The density is I think 150 or 180. I never know. But um yeah, this hair is amazing, so soft and so thick. Like look. I can barely get my fingers around it. But yeah, it says it's 24 inches, but it looks 26. I don't know if it's because I'm really small, but it looks longer than what it is. But I ain't mad at it. I ain't mad at it. <laughs> so inside there's one, two, three, four combs. Um, adjustable strap for extra security. Overall, this wig is bomb. Get yourself some Sally hair, bro. In the box comes this satin bag and in that comes a bonnet, a brochure, um, a scarf, what is it called, a satin scarf, I don't know, it's a scarf. Um, <laughs> And some wig caps. Oh no, there's lashes. And they gave me some lashes. <laughs> if you are interested in this beautiful wig, the link will be in the description box below. Now let's get into this hair slayage. I really don't know what I want to do with my hair today. I know I don't want to just straighten it or just curl it. I want to do like a style, like a half up, half down. Something different. I feel like I haven't been really creative with the looks lately. So we shall try something new. What I love is the fact that I can just put it on if I wanted to. With that glue. Do you guys see how it just melt into my skin? It looks like I've glued it on, but I haven't. I haven't done anything. Well, I have bleached the knots. That's probably why it's blending into my skin so nicely. So, I say this all the time. If you want your wig to look like scalp, you got to bleach your knots. Sorry about my armpits. They look like pussy lips. Anywho, we move. I don't know why they're so fat. Look. <laughs> the easiest and cleanest way to install your wig is do it in part. So I'm going to spray glue in the middle. Place that down. Dry it. And then go to the left and then go to the right. I really shouldn't be using my fingers, but using your fingers actually makes, uh, what's it called? Using your fingers actually make the wig a bit harder to stick onto your forehead because there's so much oils on your finger, but I don't think it's that serious. Guys, I have no edges, like, I literally rip, 
when I get tired, I just rip my hair off. Like, it's, it's too much. If I know it's ready. <laughs> See how easy that was to just... I kind of feel like it's a bit far. Caught up in oh oh they look good oh I'm about to rip this hair off and do a natural look okay we good Guys, my skin is glowing. Joy's glow. The plug. Okay, so now it's time to move on to the face. We shall curl the hair and all that later on while my lace is melting. Got mounting. Melting. Okay. So using my NYX um, primer, I'm going to apply that all over the face. It's almost done. I've had this for like three years, guys. <laughs> Am I the only one that applies primer, even though I know I'm not going anywhere? Just because it makes your makeup look that much better. Like primer is only really for like, uh, I guess primer is used to make your skin extra smooth when you have your makeup on. But it is also to make your makeup stay on longer. And I'm not going anywhere, so. It's really not that deep. I just still, I love using primer. I even need to put it on my neck. Yo, my skin is looking fab. <laughs> this makeup tutorial is gonna be proper, proper ghetto. Like, I don't even have any brow products. This is what I use for my brows, this. As you can see, it's like done. <laughs> I've abused it. Look, everything else hasn't been touched. Brush out those non-existent brows. <laughs> if you can suggest products to make my brows grow under the comments down below, I'd appreciate that a lot, okay? Come through for you, sis. I come through for you guys all the time. Return the favor. I know somebody has some good brow products out there. I love this color guys. I hate using black for my brows. It's just 
it's not a look it's not sometimes you can get away with it but overall it's not a look coming together lol what did that tiktoker say chicken and beef together five pounds of ground chicken and beef together they're going to love it <laughs> i died speaking about tiktok guys tiktok is a real addiction like i can stay on tiktok for hours three four hours without getting off the app like it's so addicting at first when i heard about tiktok i was like what's this stupid ass app for like 10 year old get that shit out of my face this shit corny as hell get get that out of my face who even uses tiktok y'all some childish ass da 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 and I don't know what made me download it, but I downloaded it, started watching videos, and I was like, this isn't so bad. I'm so happy I wasn't a vocal about my hate for TikTok. Because <laughs> y'all would have been clowning me. <laughs> Bro, why is the tip of my eyebrow shiny? Why is it grey right now? This is not the time. I think I might go in with the black on the ends. Cause what is this? Do you guys see that? What the hell? I haven't done my makeup in front of a camera for that long. Didn't even realize my brows are looking this crazy. It's going to come together. Let's not panic. It's going to come together. Right now, it's the greyest shit. What the hell is this? I think this brush is from Amazon. I'm going to conceal my brows. Why is this being so hard headed? Also, this concealer is from, um, what's it called? Beauty Bay. This is my favorite part. This literally makes or breaks the look. I have no idea what look. I want to go for all I know is I'm gonna match it with my dress so I'm probably gonna do like a green oh I don't think I've ever done a green eyeshadow look before this is going to be interesting I haven't done an eyeshadow look in a while period so this should be fun I was going through my old Instagram photos the other day just reminiscing about how much effort I used to put into my YouTube videos. Like I used to full, I used to actually do eyeshadow looks. Like, who am I? <laughs> I've gotten so lazy. Uh, actually, I wouldn't say lazy. I just have more sponsored videos now. And I'm just trying to like get videos out there. Whereas back then I was like doing my own content. I'd literally just Think of a video that day and be like oh yeah i'm gonna do that beat my face like it was fun i feel like youtube is way more fun when you're doing it for free <laughs> who can relate oh brows are looking amazing we went from no brows to Check out the glow. So guys, today I'm actually going to use an eyeshadow primer. For once. I've had this for like three damn years. So this is what it looks like by Marc Jacobs. I literally don't even remember if it was good or not. excited to see what I'm going to create today 
Damn, this is sticky. Don't remember it being this sticky. So for today's eyeshadow, I will be using the Bright Matte Palette by Beauty Bay. Amazing. Just amazing. Look at all of the colors. Guys, they're so pigmented too. <sighs> You'll see. It speaks for itself. Let me not. Okay, I think I know what I want to do. Okay. So first, I'm going to go in with... First, I'm going to go in with Slice of Lime as my first transition color. Y'all see that? I did not lie. I did not lie. <laughs> this was questionable right now but <laughs> just wait then with the same brush i'm going to go in with granny smith the one right next to it oh i think i want to do a cut crease okay and then i'm going to go in with labyrinth which is this shade right here with the same brush again really i have all these brushes but i'm using the same brush with every shade <laughs> oh my god guys it's coming together it is coming together i am liking this I give up. What's wrong with these wipes? I don't want to take the eyeshadow off. So now going in with white lies, I'm going to use a flat brush and apply that on my lid. Actually, that's a bit too white. I think I want to turn it down a bit. Yeah. So, what are we saying about this eyeshadow look? Personally, I think it's a mad cute, but we shall move on. So, my foundation is from Anastasia. What shade? 590C. Guys, this foundation is so amazing. So cheap. I think it was like 20 or 30 dollars off beauty bay i think beauty bay is like a makeup outlet because they have like all the high-end makeup but for way cheap i'm pretty sure if you was to buy this foundation at sephora it'd be like 60 or 70 dollars <sighs> crazy This foundation is so nice. I'm actually in love right now. Well, guys, I'm really, really praying this turns out good because right now I'm looking crazy. Like the eyeshadow is a bit crazy. <laughs> not sponsored but i just want to quickly shout out a black business so the lashes i will be wearing today are by empress lashes they are an australian based lash brand um i bought a few of their lashes um these are so freaking cute this is the old packaging and this is their new packaging how cute oh upside down how freaking cute 
I love the marble design and like the lash how it's like winking just so freaking cute guys they have all their business info in the back love the glittery design on the sides guys you just have to go check them out I've been wearing Empress lashes for like a year now they never disappoint okay <laughs> here I have hot girl so freaking cute so I like wearing these when I don't want to do too much and then hot girl when I want to do the absolute most like right now <laughs> um, I'm missing one right now don't even worry about that here I have I'm missing another pair woman crush every day I'll leave a photo here on what it looks like yeah definitely go check them out I'm so excited to see how this look is going to come together like with the lashes and the hair oh my god this is going to be a look my eyeshadow kind of creased in there but it's okay luckily I'm not going anywhere this is just for photos but what do you guys actually think about this look it's cute right Here's a close-up. I didn't really like it without the wing, but I feel like the wing just, the wing just puts it all together. The wing and then the lips. If you're wondering, this is what I use for my lips. And for the lip liner, I use dark brown eyeshadow. <laughs> Lashes are on. How do they look? Yes or no? Time for the hair. Okay, what are you doing? Ooh. Ooh, let me fix this. Guys, I'm in love. This hair is so soft. Oh my god, this dress is so freaking big on me. done my little half up half down and now I'm gonna curl the hair this dress is really annoying me so time to curl this hair curler is from Kmart oh my god let's do that again <laughs> probably pretty cheap I don't exactly know how much but it was pretty cheap and it goes up to 200 so y'all know I have to trap the heat in a little bit voila ooh ooh Your girl is looking so cute. Actually, I don't know. I don't like. I don't like the beginning. Let's do that again. Hmm. I see no change. That's better. I'm curling in really big sections because it's getting late. I've been filming. For like three to four hours now, no joke. With YouTube, you gotta have all the time in the world. 
because filming takes ages. Imagine, imagine how long you do your makeup without filming. What, maybe one, two hours, sometimes for three hours. Now add filming to it. For those who want to be YouTubers. <laughs> I'm not saying don't do it. I'm just saying you gotta, you gotta have a lot of time in your hands. I know I say, oh my god, my fake hair, this is my fake hair all the time, but I'm actually being dead ass. Ooh, guys, it's coming together. Coming together nicely. I don't want the curls to be too curly, I want them to be like just loose bouncy i need to step back a bit that's touches of the hair using this hair serum came up so this cute little dress is from pretty little thing um, I don't think you can quite see it properly, but if I was to wear this dress, I would probably pair it with this cute bag. This bag is from Princess Polly. I do have a code for you guys. <laughs> So guys, that was the end of today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye-bye. See a bad bitch and she already know it. Yes, you know it. Yes, you know it. Yeah, yeah, she know it. Yes, you know it.